two, one. Hello and good afternoon everyone. Adam here at Kenyon Classic Cars in Clarence, Iowa. This afternoon, we are very proud to show you the latest addition to our inventory. This 1967 Chevrolet Chevelle Super Sport. Now, this car is a true Super Sport. It is a 138 VIN code car. And this car has the 396 engine in it. It is a numbers matching engine. Numbers matching drivetrain. As far as we know, the engine is definitely numbers matching. And as far as we know, that's a couple fingerprints on there wiping off. But this car is numbers matching drivetrain, engine, transmission, rear end. Um, everything's matching on the car. Um, I have not verified that, but my, a friend of mine has owned this car for 30 plus years. Um, this car is absolutely gorgeous. He's very meticulous. He was a mechanic most of his life, so he's very meticulous. The car runs like it should, it drives like it should, it stops like it should. Um, just an all in all great car. Now he restored this car around 20 years ago. He took it all apart, put it all back together, and like I say, I don't think they get much better than this. 396, four speed car, uh, red car, red interior, bucket seats, council, 350 horse, 396, highly detailed engine compartment. Um, underneath the hood is all painted up really nice. All your insulation is still there, all intact. Um, just a very, very nice uh, car. The, uh, it's got the right battery cables, battery hold downs on it, right battery top on it. Um, it retains its original um, exhaust manifolds. Uh, the only thing that I know of that's not original in this car is the carburetor. And my buddy was always going to try to find the, the right carburetor for it, and he just never, never was able to locate the exact carburetor for the car. Now, the car is beautiful. The paint on this car is very, very nice. As you can see, the door gaps on this car, your panel alignment is very, very well. It, your lines are good all the way down your doors front and back. Your doors open and shut just like they should. There's not very many imperfections in this car at all. We got these, we're under these bright LED lights so you can always see if there's imperfections in these cars. Um, but this car looks very, very nice. Again, your trunk gaps, your trunk lines up very well on both sides as well as the front of your trunk. The chrome bumpers in this car are in good shape. All your bright work around your windows is in good shape as well. All the glass in this car looks very, very good. A couple minor little scratches on a couple pieces of glass, nothing even to talk, we're talking about. Um, your door handles are in good shape. The chrome on those is good. As we open the door of the car up and look at the inside of the car, you'll notice your door panels, they look like brand new. Your sill plates look good. Um, it's red interior, red carpeting, red back seat, headliner, your dome light is working. Your visors are all there, they're both there and they're, they're intact. The back of your seats are nice. The whole interior in this car is very, very nice. Your sail panels look great, your headliner looks great, your carpeting's very nice. Mm -hmm. There's your jams. Now this car, like I say, it's been restored for 20 years, maybe a tick better. So it's, it shows very, very well. It's a very good quality restoration. Is it a 100 point show car? No, is it gonna take, you'll be able to take this car to your church car shows or any car show you want. Not Super Chevy Nationals, but this car is gonna win trophies for you. You're gonna have a lot of fun in this car. Um, your door seams here are all, all still intact. All your spot factory spot welds are still there. You have a GM tag on your door. Just like the other side, this door shuts perfect. Same way the panel alignment on this side of the car is great too. Um, just an all in all beautiful car. Has one little rock chip right here. Just a tiny little rock chip. But I will point that out to you. Your front bumper is in good shape. It looks nice. The chrome is nice on your front bumper. Like I say, the engine bay is very, very nicely detailed. The engine in this car was rebuilt. The transmission was gone through. The rear engine has gone through. It's got 
373, Turbo Posi 373 gears in the back of this car. So you can drive this car down the road and enjoy it. It's not going to be wrapped out to 5,000 RPMs going down the interstate at 65 or 70, so that's a good thing. Um, as you'll see, it's got the correct rally wheels, chrome rally wheels with caps. It's got a set of Cooper Cobra Radial GT raised white letter tires on it. Just a great car, all in all, great car. This side of the car is just like the other side. It's got the SS steering wheel on it. The seats are very, very nice, very comfortable seats. Center console with the clock down below. It does have a tic-tac, tic-tock tack here on the left side. Um, the dash has all the gauges in it. it has a fuel gauge, battery, your uh, voltage gauge, oil pressure and temperature. KenyanAuto.com. I have one tail light that's out there. We'll have to fix that. If you are looking for a beautiful 1967 Chevelle, numbers matching, 396, four speed, and it is a real super sport car, look no further. Kenyan Classic Cars, Clarence, Iowa. Give us a call today. www.KenyanAuto.com. We buy, sell, and trade collector cars, muscle cars, and regular inventory daily. We are very happy to talk to you about this car or maybe another car that we have in stock. Please give us a call. We stock over 100 collector cars. Chevelles, Camaros, Novas. Look us up on our website. Check us out. Thanks for watching our videos. We really appreciate it. We hope you have a wonderful day. And thanks for watching this video over this 1967 Chevelle Supersport.